Welcome to Netlane Daily, where all your killstreaks and headshot dreams come true. Killing spree. The Corsair Vengeance 2100 pairs Dolby 7.1 surround sound gaming audio with true wireless freedom. Enter coupon code Corsair Vengeance to redeem free shipping within Canada and the US. In an effort to spread Wi-Fi love to even the most remote places of the Earth, Google is pushing forward with Project Loon. Real quick for those who don't remember, Google X is using weather balloons set up near the edge of space to connect people to the internet in rural and remote areas. One year later, they've done away with limited range Wi-Fi and switched to LTE hotspots that can get up to 22 megabytes with dedicated antennas or 5 megabytes to phones within range. Over the next 12 months, they're hoping to create a ring of 300 to 400 balloons that circle the globe, offering continuous service. Google, please send some over to Richmond, BC. Service in an office is terrible. Speaking of getting to remote areas, Dr. David Harris-Smith and Dr. Frauke Zeller have gathered a team to create Hitchbot, a motionless bot who will attempt a 3,871 mile trek across Canada. It uses its 3G and Wi-Fi capabilities to access Wikipedia and social media while utilizing speech processing and recognition to communicate. The plan is to set it loose on July 27th in Halifax, Nova Scotia and set it on its mission to reach Victoria, BC, all while sharing updates on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter along the way. With all the hype around humans trusting robots, it'll be interesting to see if robots can trust us. But then again, it's hitchhiking in Canada, so I'm pretty sure it's going to just be fine. Hitchbot, you're always welcome in my car. Michael Thomason has received over $750,000 for his hoarding, <clears throat> I mean collecting. Yes, the 41-year-old video game historian held the Guinness World Record for the largest video game archive, including over 11,000 games with several full catalogs and one quarter of them factory sealed. Apparently, this isn't the first time that he sold his entire collection, and should the opportunity arise, he doesn't rule out starting all over again. I mean, I have a hard enough time to decide between playing Hardline and revisiting a modded Watch Dogs Chicago. I don't even want to think about that many video games. Whoop, whoop. So I know you're sitting there with those headphones on watching Netlinked and you're thinking, these are just not comfy. The sound, it's mediocre. Well, we've got the cure. Hit this link up right here, right here, for your chance to win a limited edition T90 Jubilee from Bayer Dynamic. It's kind of a big deal. There's like only a thousand of them being made. All right, guys, that's it for Netlink Daily. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this. Also, side effects of watching Netlink Daily include increase in heart rate, sweating, difficulty breathing, dysentery, vampirism, virginity, diabetes, and sugar high. Always read and follow the label. Ask your doctor if Netlink is right for you.